Hey everyone, Blue Shadow RP here, recording some more Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, and in this video, I decided to try out some modes in the Games and More section, and in this video, we're going to be trying out Mob Smash. Um, yeah, it's pretty simple, it's basically the, uh, the, pretty much the mode where you battle, I guess, um, a bunch of enemies, and you can take them out rather easily, but they've become more difficult over time. Um... And we just have three modes this time around, okay. But, uh, yeah, before we get into this, I just want to say that, um, I didn't upload Smash videos for, like, a couple of days because, um, I had some finals to finish up, so I'm done with those. And now I have a good amount of time off to where I can do pretty much what I want and also upload videos at the same time. And also tonight I'm being be I'm going to be playing, uh, Splatoon because I think there's another Splatfest, except this one's more of a crossover between... Smash Ultimate and that game, so, um, that's thought it'd be exciting. And then, uh, yeah, I'll try out some more stuff within Smash, uh, Smash Bros. Ultimate. So, we have Sentry Smash, All-Star Smash, and Cruel Smash. Uh, we'll do Sentry Smash to start out with. And we'll just go to Battlefield, but we can actually pick this H, which is interesting. Because usually for this kind of mode, it's, um... It's always... It's always Battlefield, but let's go with Mega Man, because I want to try someone else different than Snake, because uh, some of his attacks might not be ideal, in my mind, anyways. Ready? Go! Yeah, so, right now they're easy to uh, take out, although you shouldn't let them linger on for too long, otherwise they might start to overwhelm you. Let's see if I can actually take a hundred of these guys out. Although it's not all just me fighters, there are going to be a few uh, characters that show up um, after the certain amount that you've defeated. So. Also, these guys, I don't think they can recover that well either, so... They just have that one jump and that's it. Yeah, sometimes they, uh, they have items too to help you out. Such as bombs as well. I don't know, sometimes I expect them to come at me, but sometimes they don't want to do that, so... I think you can maybe change the difficulty on this, I'm not, although I'm not sure if I missed that or not. Yeah, these guys cannot recover well. I'm just gonna start tossing these guys. And there we go, that should be it. Alright, so that's my record for Mega Man. Two minutes and 35 seconds, looks like. And we also did a challenge as well, I knew it. Clear it within four minutes, I think it said, or under four minutes. Alright. One century smash for the first time. Okay. I think that's it, really. Okay. So now next we have All-Star Smash, which is also another mode 
uh, we could play, where we pretty much defeat all the fighters, except a group of them at a time, like, for the franchise that you're- that they're in. Um, I'm not sure if I want to do that, or if it's gonna take up time, but let's do Cruel Smash. Let's skip to Cruel Smash. Now, Cruel Smash is pretty- pretty hardcore, because instead of the guys being easy to take out, uh, with, like, dummies, per se, uh, they've been rather improved uh, a lot, and if you get ambushed by them, you're pretty much dead. Um, probably less than 10 seconds, but I know there's probably like a challenge out there that there is like a certain amount you gotta defeat, and I think in Super Smash Bros. for Wii U, the ideal character to do that with was uh, Marth, or probably Lucina or something because of their recovery, and then they'll just fall down. Um, from time to time because the recovery isn't so well. But, um, let's try, I don't know, let's try Ike because his recovery can dish out a lot of hits. But yeah, just run to the uh, edge or run to the ledge and, uh, hang on. Yeah. Ow. Yeah. Okay. So you can see a dramatic difference there. Wow, I can't believe I made that. And yeah, I was pretty much dead there. Um, we'll give it another chance and then we'll check out um, 100 man... 100... Or All-Star Smash, that's right. Yeah, let's go with uh, Marth, like I said. And let's see if that makes any difference. Ready, go. Okay. Ouch. Okay, yeah. Mm hmm. I don't think I'll be able to do that on video, but, um. I killed one, apparently. I didn't even see it. KO'd an opponent and Cruel Smash for the first time. Such an accompli accomplishment to do just that. Okay, so next we're gonna be trying out um, All-Star Smash. I think this is the one that probably takes a while because... Or if they just appear, I don't know. So... I'm going to go with, uh, let's just go with Mega Man again, since I, w I went with him last time. Alright, so, it may be similar to, uh, Sentry Smash. Although, I, it, it does look, it does have that, um, endless smash feel to it, so we just gotta defeat as many as we can. Although, keep in mind that these guys can also use a recovery, so that is also one bit of difference from the other guys. And just, I guess, set the highest record possible, so... Also, that could be based in within Challenge Factor as well, so good to have that in mind. So. I'm just pretty much doing most of my smash attacks, my my grabs to try to get the upper edge here. And Ryu kind of knew what he was doing right there because he was trying to spike me into the ground. Oh, and that was my fault. Yep. So, I defeated 18 that time. Um, there is also the opportunity to 
improve my score. But uh, we won some money, or spear points, and it says play All-Star Smash alone and KO an opponent three times. Alright. So, that is pretty much Mob Smash. I was kind of expecting more, because in the previous games we had a lot more modes to choose from. Um, but yeah, I think Cruel Smash is going to be the toughest. Unless if there's like a viable strategy to use in order to kill those guys. Um, but honestly, I think your best bet is just to stay on the ledge and try and bait them if you can. Um, but yeah, that's going to do it for this video. Of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like down below, as it helps me out tremendously, and I will see you guys again soon. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.